What's up YouTube? In this video, I'm going to show you the AOKP for that you have to. So let's go ahead and boot this up. Turn it on real quick. That's the kernel I'm running on right now. Alright. That's the regular OKB okay, boot up. Swear I got activated. <laughs> That's a definitely dope. Okay. Because there's lower the screen right there. There we go. Alright, so let's get into it. Um, as you guys know from previous uh, videos, um, I'm rocking the motor over widgets, the whole UI, and uh, all that. <coughs> so I can just flip the rings here and flip it there, and you can take it to the settings. Yeah, I can show you the battery. There's the battery left right there. Zero lemon, of course. All right. Crazy, crazy hours right there. And you can just flip the rings there. So it's, it's pretty sick. You know, pretty sick as you guys can see. All right, I'm rocking the. What do we got here? Uh, the blood red theme. Going to themes. There it is, blood red, by Team Carbon. This theme is my favorite um, theme for the AOSB based ROMs. It's uh, by Team Carbon. They make the blue. They make uh, like an orange, orangey theme and things like that. As you guys can see, pull off from the drop down. Got the little Android guy right there. Wood sprint. Shout out the friends grapes. Just see me back on Voxer. So let's clear notifications. Let's move this screen real quick. Nice clear notifications there. Um, as you can see with this theme here, everything is themed out. Alright? Everything's themed out nice. Even the battery icon. Get them blowing up here, notifications. <laughs> see, uh, the circle battery is uh, themed out. Wi Fi, you know, things like that. Signal. Got that time there. Alright, let's take it into the center real quick. As you guys can see with AOKP, you have uh, Rob Control, AOKP Updater, Themes, Kernel Settings, Clock Settings, uh, Device Options. Let's just take it to the ROM Control. And these are all the different settings you can do with AOKP. Very uh, customizable. Um, you know, you got the junior UI, you got the lock screen here, you know, you can set it however you want. And as you can see, I have that set. You can set up to eight, and that's all the options you have with that. The power menu right there. This is, you can set it to, well, let's say, um, the torch is like the flashlight, but I have that off. But these are just some of the things that you can have it set. So let's say an example. Hold the hold the power. I can set it to let's say I take a screenshot. And you know, as you guys see, it just took a screenshot. Anyway, I play mode, uh, volume status. You know, just a regular shit. Reboot on lock screen. So let's say hold the hold the power again. Yeah, you reboot. You got the option to reboot into a recovery or download mode. So if you want to go into a uh, your recovery, whether it's Clockwork Mod or Torp, you can uh, do it from uh, holding the power for a couple seconds. It'll give you that option. So we're not going to do that. Navigation bar. This is just if you want to do uh, navigations or anything like that. I don't got that set up. Uh... The navigation rain. <coughs> Some people like it. I'm not a big fan of it. Uh, but you can do that if you want. 
what else? Genuine UI right there. You can uh, take away the um, boot animation, disable the boot animation. Uh, custom carrier label where you can just, from the lock screen, you can type in, let's say, AOKP ROM. Right. This is for an example. Hit OK. Now, when I unlock the phone, let's get out of that. When you unlock the phone, oh, now it doesn't want to do it. <laughs> let's do it. That's weird. Let's see. Sometimes you have to unlock, have it unlocked for like a couple seconds for it to actually recognize the unlock screen. Okay. Anyways, for some reason it's not uh, showing the lock screen. But anyway, it'll, it'll just say OKP okay, ROM, whatever. You know, whatever you have it set to. So, it's uh, it's not that bad. And then, of course, you got the regular AOSP camera. No photosphere. Uh, not a big deal. Um, these are some of the apps I have installed here. Nothing there. Uh, not crazy. Let's go back in the center real quick. You got the regular clock settings right there. What else? So we're using. Let's go into about phone. All right. As you guys can see, it's 4.2.2. The kernel version is 3.4. The um, kernel I'm running is the K Tunes kernel. And it's from May 9th, so that is the um, kernel you want to get. Double tap 4.2.2, and you got Android Jelly Bean right there. That's pretty cool. <coughs> and as you guys can see, if you hold the if you can hold down the home button, you get that kill all. So that's definitely pretty cool. That feature is definitely uh, pretty sick. You can't be that at all. So, what else I'm going to show you guys? You know, it's basically pretty quick. You know, it's not bad. Let's do a quick benchmark here. Um, with they always P based, they're not really too high. Um, what I'm gonna do for the hell of it? Just wanna benchmark real quick. Now, when I was on stock rooted, um, you know, stock touchless based ROMs, it was uh, within 6,000, 5,000 range. But on all the OSP based ROMs, it was like, you know, the 4,000 range. So, I'll let you guys uh, watch a little benchmark there real quick. You guys can check that out. Now, in the meantime, when this is running, I'm going to do a uh, another video probably next week. I'm going to flash an AOSP-based ROM, which is uh, by Team Venom. <coughs> it's Team Uh Probably going to flash it tonight and uh, see how that ROM is. If the ROM is any good with uh, no bugs, I'll do a video on that ROM as well. But uh, this ROM is uh, pretty stable. No, I haven't had any issues with this ROM. And I've been running for like over two weeks now, so pretty decent and with that kernel I'm getting a battery life of course I'm rocking <laughs> zero lemon too so I don't normally rock the slim so let's check out the score let's see okay, there's a score right there alright like I said they have speed based ROMs always score low they normally don't uh, have a high score not a big deal. Like I said, the ROM's blazing fast. Let's open up, uh, let's open up a YouTube. Let's open up YouTube right there. Check out a video. Let's check out some J Audio speakers. YouTube. This is me, uh, Pippin94553. 
my last video, or I had a few videos. Alright. YouTube's works no problem. Like I said, everything works with the Rob. I haven't had any, any, uh, you know, any real issues with it. At all, really. So, otherwise, I want to be running it because I don't like with the ROMs that are like buggy. I know I was running uh, the CM10 uh, 10.1. Um, it was that RC1 and the RC2. That was a little buggy, so I dumped it. Um, it had a problem with the MMS. So, but this ROM the MMS works. Um, let's see. Now, I'll show you Ghost MS Pro, but I got my Texas in there now. But <laughs> as you guys can see, I'm running a. Uh, Go SMS Pro right there, and that is a uh, nice, uh, nice Texan app right there. So that was just a video on AOKP. If you have any questions, just hit me up in the message or draw a comment. So I'll catch you guys later. Peace.